So there's a 21 Savage film and soundtrack dropping on Friday. And I think it's called what? The Story of 21 Savage? Yeah, The American Dream or something. The, story, American the 21 Dream. Savage Story. Yeah, so pretty wild. Like, I, It's weird though, because the commercials and trails I saw like, I didn't know there's like a long ass video. Same. But like, yeah. apparently it's like a full feature film. So yeah, yeah so your thoughts, your, your idea on just that. Um, I thought the song was pretty cool. It was a, speaking of um, being a little different. I, I think the it was a nice change of pace for Twenty One Savage. Like mm. normally, he's just talking about catching bodies and everything. This one was a bit more uh, introspective. It seems I didn't fully listen to the lyrics because I was busy focusing on the visuals. Sure, yeah, kind of random. Um, I feel like this will either be really good or really bad. And I say that. Yeah, because... there's no in between. 100%. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> the two actors, Childish Gambino and the guy from Stranger Things, I forget his name, forgive me, um, don't resemble 21 Savage in any way. But if this is kind of like, um, like almost satirical in a way, then I think it could be go really well if it's not like mm. taken too seriously. But if it's like straight up a biopic and they're just playing him from child to adult, then it's going to, in my opinion, come across very corny, corny. and yeah, corny. try hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, this has a very fun, which I think is why they probably are like, it's almost like a shock drop, right? Mm -hmm. I think if you give people too much time to think about this, they'll be like, wait, what the fuck am I getting excited for? Kind of yeah. a thing. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for it, bro. Honestly, like, dude, I think 21 Savage isn't even 30 years old yet, but... Bro, his life seems pretty wild, right? To come mm -hmm. from London, to be, to leave, to not be allowed back into the country until your late 20s. Like, the shit he's achieved financially. 31. 31. Okay, so like, the shit he's done in 31 years seems pretty intense, right? So, to see it played out in film seems pretty exciting. I'm, I'm excited about that. But yeah, I'm very curious. I think the Gambino part gives it a level of credibility, though, mm. that you kind of need to take it serious, right? Because I feel like yeah. Atlanta is a great example of like, yes, they're trying to be funny here, but there's a true meaning coming through in these shows if you truly pay attention, right? So mm -hmm. I do hope that there's going to be, like that's going to come through in whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, I think the Gambino is what gave me hope where I'm like, correct, this is going to, it's going to be funny, but there's going to be a lot of truth and yes. like a serious underlying message that comes out of it.